everybody. So today we're going to continue talking about how to show ownership with apostrophe S. And I'm going to talk about a mistake that I see grown adults make all the time. So as we learned last time, we use apostrophe S to show that somebody owns something, that it belongs to them, like Miss Izzy's dog, or Jose's t-shirt, or the cat's collar. Apostrophe S is not for making things plural. So if you have more than one of something, ¿verdad? un plural, más que uno, that is not when you should use apostrophe S. So these are not three cats. This apostrophe, no, we do not need it. These are three cats, no apostrophe. Very good. The dog's toy is destroyed. The toy belongs to the dog, so we should use an apostrophe here. So again, put the apostrophe to show ownership. Don't put it for plurals. So for today's homework, you're going to look at four sentences and decide if they need an apostrophe or not. I'll show you this one as an example. The house's door is red because the door belongs to the house. We can think of a, about it like the house owns the door. Now this one's a plural. The dogs are black. So do we need an apostrophe there? Hmm, I'll let you decide. Remember, you may not put an apostrophe on every sentence. And then on the second page, you'll write some of your own sentences. Ready? Let's get started.